Right. Here we are. So, I think I'll wait till it's light time a bit more. Rain doesn't help too much. Unless there's a storm back there, that'll be interesting. Okay, um, I'm just going to tell everyone what I'm doing, okay, while we're bouncing around in the ocean. Now, I've already done like a bit of a practice go, but um, this is another video of the same thing. And where we are is just east of Dragon Cliffs. Now, if anyone knows Dragon Cliffs and has learnt from perhaps Sim Gamer TV, where you hit the land, and you might have read the uh, comments and seen my comment, but if you're coming in from the east, you hug the right, so you hug the, the starboard side of the north of the cliffs there, of the opening, and you just hug that, and then you can go straight into port, and on the way out, you go the same way, so you just hug the, uh, the cliffs to the north of the opening, and then you hug the same island, I guess you could call it, if you look crane your neck towards the map and you'll see that there's a there's a little island on the north of the uh, opening and that's where Sim Gamer and many, even I have uh, a couple of times at least um, stranded myself on that um, sunken hazard but you just hug the right it's very tight but you've just got that one one area to hug. Now I've just heard a storm coming in. Oh, there it is. So I'm going to start moving because I was going to teach fishing and I'll still be able to teach it on the way in. So I'm going to head in from the east. So I'm going to hug the, the right. So that's the, the mountain there on the. That's I'm looking at there. I need to get away from that. Now the wind. Let's get this anchor up. We'll have a look at this wind. But we're going to do all this with our rod in our hand, which is a very manly thing to do. Would you believe the wind is going towards us? So that's fun, isn't it? So what we're going to do is let that out for now. And this one as well. So I'm just holding shift and it just lets lines out really good. I'm just going to turn this to... Oh, I'll show you the quick turn with this as well if you don't know. So it's shift, then you click with the left mouse, then you choose the direction you want it to spin. So you do it really... I'm holding shift, then press F and then D. There you go, I think we're already there. You know, that's left, that's right. So hold, sh press shift, click, and then direction. So we're already starting to move now. So it's actually, oh, I wanted to actually make that a bit tight now. <laughs> I didn't know it would have spin that much, but I guess it's quite windy with this storm. So now we're turning. So now we'll raise this sail. Oh, we'll do actually. Start fishing. There you are. Oh, it's already in. Huh, that's good. Don't know what happened there. Oh. Spin that over. Now pull this in a little bit so we get a little bit of speed. All right, round and round we go. I didn't lock that in, so it's going back to where we wanted. And now off we go. And where's the wind right behind us? So let this out. All right, so I'm just fishing the whole time. See how I haven't dropped? 
drop the um, the rod and staring out the back window like a lot of people do. You don't need to. See that flip? That is the rod with a fish on it. Now I'm pulling down the halyard, if you don't know that. I just clicked on the halyard. And now I'm just moving around. There goes the storm. No, no thing, is it? Uh, so there's no need to stand out the back like this. And Oh, it's pretty close. That's good. So we'll get this eel in by the looks of it. Always good to have a bit of a nuggy. Uh, get the hook. Now I'll grab the hook out before. Put it on. Lift it up. Uh, I'm just going to throw it forwards because it doesn't matter. So I need to move. Turn sharp. It's been a while since I played, so I'm a bit cheery here. So I'm just hoisting that mainsail reef a little bit there. While actually, I need to let it out. I knew I had to do something with it. Now we're going to hug the right and make sure we don't hit anything. But this is a storm happening and everything. And I'm still fishing while sailing. It's just to show people that you don't even have to stand at the back window, like I'm saying. So I'm navigating through here, hugging the right. I don't even know what's on the left. I just know that this right hand side. And the starboard side, whatever you want to call it, since we're in the water, eh? Just hug that side, and we're good. And I was just steering then. Might not be able to see it. Oh, and you don't even have to get behind the steering wheel. A lot of people do. And if you want to see what's on the side there, you can just stand on the port or starboard side and just hold the... Oh, that's a wind change there. Yeah. Bit of luffing, you hear that? So let's pull it in a bit. Actually, I need to drop it a little bit because ain't no rush. Pull that in a bit. This might turn our, star, our stern to the. Oh, I got fish! So now I'm just reeling, while navigating through this tight dragon cliff. Oh, I just broke it. <laughs> anyway, so I was going a little hard there. Practice makes perfect. Like I said, I haven't played for a while. I just wanted to make sure that everyone kind of knew that you can... Oh, the fish line's already out, so that's good. Let us navigate some more. Wow, um, I have not played in a long time, and I'm very, very, very rusty, because I've just got myself stuck in the water, I'm actually going backwards more than we're going forwards. You can tell, but uh, yeah, I did it way too much, still laughing. Okay, now this is a this is a major fail on my part. But as you can see I'm still fishing. Now <laughs> I've got a lot of work to do here, but I'm still fishing. This just shows how bad I am as well. Oh I double clicked. That's the trick with it. You don't wanna like double click. Oh, another hook. I'm not having a good day. Might have to do this again. <laughs> uh, the storm hasn't helped at all. Right, let's go this way. Right, 
Let's show how you get out of irons as well. So it's loosey goosey. Pushy pushy. So I've turned the the rudder to the port side. So we're going to reverse port. I just got to make sure I push this over a bit. Go that way. Okay. Now let's pull in tight. Pull tight, pull tight. Heave ho! Alright. That'll do, eh? Now, just sailing now. <laughs> anyway, that is how you get out of irons as well. Now, this is fish, we're throwing it in. Um, just going to pull this down because um, one sail is enough at half mast to, to get in. Around we go. Oh, we've already got a fish. So I'm steering now, but I'm also watching out. When you're sailing, it's all about being visual outside the boat more than inside. I'm also reeling. This, uh, I might actually keep this. It's a bloody train wreck and probably way too long. But you get the gist of it, and you can also get yourself out of irons by going reverse and pushing your boom forward or to the to the um, side of the boat, so it catches the wind and pushes you backwards. A bit like having a square. I think my mouse wheel is more sensitive than I thought it was. It was quite a lot of work here. All right, so. I'm not even going to bring the fish in yet. I'm going to drop this. Now release that. And the fish should be pretty close. You can tell by the rod going to the left. Bam. I'm just going to put that away. It'll take that hook again too. Alright. Let's just pop on in. Now that was a train wreck of a how-to. But I hope it shows people that you can just go below deck and everything and still be able to fish nothing you can't do while you're fishing well there's a few things but <laughs> it at least doesn't have to be a hindrance to you oh, I said I haven't played for a while Um, one thing you can't do is do this view and reel, but probably everyone knows that already. And I'm sorry that was such a train wreck. I hope it taught a lot of people a few things, or taught a few things to a lot of people. Um, how to, sailwind, fishing. And this might not be my last video on Sailwind. I have been dreaming about playing it again. I bought my own boat. And it's just a small Kareel 18, if you want to Google that. And, um, yeah. I thought I would do this video so everyone can fish. Thank you.